What is up everybody, it's Gorilla Man here, back with another Farming Simulator 2017 video, and today we're going to be doing some single player, uh, working on the farm per usual. Uh, so in last episode, we, or last few episodes, I think last two actually, we've been doing a lot of stuff with chaff, and the chaff just finished, uh, what do you call it, fermenting, and we're going to go over there right now and check it out. I currently got some hay with me. I'm just going to drop it off right over here, right by the cows, because the cows are getting hungry. And we need that production from the cows to be making a lot of money. So, oh, right over here. Went a little too far, but that's fine. All right, see, so yeah, I'm just going to drop this off. Then I'm going to show you how everything is going with the chaff. We still have to harvest, like, a lot of it. I think it might almost be done, but I'm not 100% sure yet. All right, let's just... Squeeze in here. All right, let's drop these off. And now this should be the hay, and those other ones right there are grass. I just have to make sure I remember that and don't mess it up later. All right, so do you, is it you to detach? All right. Then hit Y again. Okay, we're good. All right, so it said the fermenting had finished. So, let's grab this guy, but we need a bucket, let's go find the bucket. Alright, helper I nearly has a full grain tank, ooh, well, we'll have to go pick that grain tank up, oh they finished though, did helper I really finish already? Oh no, Helper Eye was somebody else, okay. I thought that was the one that was working on all the corn, getting the chaff, I was like, what? There's no way they finished that chaff already. All right, so we got this. All right, let's see what happens. Probably gonna have to grab that, but this is okay. All right, so what you did, what we did was open it. Bunker silo was opened. All right, so it looks like it, maybe it just only took half of it off. I don't know. So it's at a 61,000 worth of silage. So the plan that I'm thinking about everybody is just filling this bunker up with, with as much chaff as I can manage to make, pretty much. And then just basically never ever have to make silage again, or at least for a very long time. Oh yeah, there it goes. See, now it's moving. To get about 1800 per bucket load that's not bad um, pretty sure like, there's like another bucket that's a lot bigger I'm not sure if this is the universal bucket or the other one was but either way let's drive over here and while we drop this in here we'll also uh, we'll attach to it and take it over here with us because this is we gotta we gotta start making that power food again uh, we did power food about a few weeks ago but we are already running out Alright, we should have some kind of power food mixture in there now. Not sure if it's exactly 100% what we need. I don't think it's 100%. Oh, hey, that took it as... I think that took it as grass. Hmm. Well, let's go over here and find out what this one is then. Well, that is weird. There's definitely a difference in these two. Um, yeah, there's a difference in these two colors. This one's lighter. This one's darker. So this one is definitely the hay. But if we go and look, let me think. I'm trying to think of a way we can tell whether or not. So I think hay is the little grass with a star on it. So then that must mean have around. Oh, there we go. All right, here, I'm gonna hook up the Dodge to, I'm gonna hook up the Cummins to this food mixer. There we go. So yeah, we're missing, we have grass, but we're missing the hay, or silage. Yucky, yeah, 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 I see what I'm doing. All right, all right, all right, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. So we need to attach, let's 
drop this. We need to get the bale fork. Or bale spike, whatever. I don't remember what this one's called. We need to grab some of the hay. I think. I'm not sure if it matters or not right now. I think it could be. Yeah, this is this is what we need right here. See how the little uh, bottom right hand corner, you see how that the blue little thing of grass right there has the little star next to it, little asterisk. I think that means it is the hay. And I just made this, so. Alright. Alright, so we definitely have a good food mixture going right now. Turn on the mixer wagon. It says we're only at 84% though, so we could fit maybe one more in here. I think we can fit maybe one more thing of hay in here, so let's try that. Just, uh, stab him. Tilt the back so we look good. Alright. Make this power food mixture and get our cows. Whoa, there. Get our cows producing. Alright, we're gonna back this up over to the other side. Alright, and we are good to go. Alright, so we're just gonna drive up. I think, yeah, we can empty on this side. So we're gonna drive up right here next to this. Let me show you this really quick where we're at. So see, cows, productivity, going about half. They're, they're starving right now. Cows are starving. So we, I'm gonna start feeding them a little bit more. Push this guy out of our way. All right, and let's unload. So we're getting their power food, their grass, their silage, or not their grass. We're getting the power food and everything back up, which is what we want. And there's some grass uh, bales right there that we can snag. Full load did quite a bit. We've finished off about a little under half. It's not bad though. Alright, but... There we go. Alright, so we're now we're going to grab some of these grass bales and toss them in there. And then we're going to go grab some water and then we will resume the chaff making. Alright. There we go. Picked it up all delicate. Come on, there we go. Now what are we at? Got some more grass in them. So yeah, we need some water. Let's do one more. One more thing of grass. Yeah, that should be good. Yep. Yeah, we have field 19. Field 19 is like our grass area. There we go. Alright. Hop back in our truck. And let's go over to the sheep area, I think, is where we want to go. Let's check out the map really quick. What do we got over here? There we go. Yeah, we want to go get our water tank. Oh, and shout out to whoever said... In the last video, whoever said that you hit 8 or 7 on the map to turn up the speed, thank you for that. That's probably going to help me out a lot because I'm always changing the speed. Oh my gosh. I'm always changing the speed of the game. So I'm definitely going to be using that. So thank you for whoever said that. I do read your comments. So I saw that one. Thank you very much. I do not remember the name of the person, sadly. But I, I, should, I, I think I'll try and toss it up here, actually. I'll try and toss it up. Thank you. Uh, so whoever that was. But here we go. Let's see which way is this facing? Ooh, tasting this. Oh yeah, I forgot. Spencer is the one who brought this one. We had Spencer help us out with our, uh, with our sheep. Uh, how are our sheep doing? I never did check the sheep. Um. All right, so yeah, they're doing pretty good. Uh, I guess cleanliness is not doing too well, but wool. They are producing slowly but surely. gonna uh -oh, pull forward a little bit. We're gonna unload everything all this while we're here. Alright, they can't take any more. So since we only have four sheep, uh sheep really do not use that much resources or that many resources compared to our cows at the moment. 
These cows we have what? 22? That means we, actually we've bred two, so we have two baby calves, technically. Um, I think they're just full-grown adults because they don't actually show the calves, but, but, we have produced two, which is technically we've made two. I do uh, ten thousand dollars. Yeah, yeah, they're they're ten, they're five thousand a piece, I think, right? Yeah, yeah, ten thousand dollars. It's either ten or eight thousand dollars. Either way, that's a nice profit that we've made off of the cows so far. Um, I mean, and that's not including like the daily like milk fees we get, which is roughly around seventeen thousand right now. Um, it's more like depending upon how much I've done for the cows, like how well fed they are, basically the productivity and whatnot. But yeah, so. We're gonna be trying to fill up this whole thing right here for chaff. Um, just fill it. I'm just, just fill it up, okay? Just top it off. Uh, maybe do two or three different loads of, or two or three different like fields worth of chaff. Like maybe do field 12 three or four times with just pure corn. Um, we're not really making any money as we're turning it all into chaff, but. I do that a few times and we're pretty much set. So I'm gonna drive back over to field 12. This field 12 has got a helper on it and they need me to go empty that thing of chaff. And then I don't know what'll happen with this. Um, so we have silage inside of the bunker right now. And if we put more chaff in there, I'm not sure if it'll convert everything back to chaff or everything to silage or be half and half. I don't know what'll happen, we're gonna try it just to see what happens. Um, so that'll be interesting. All right, wow. I have a lot of machinery now that I look at. I need to go through and I need to pay off. I need to, so yeah, okay, by the way, I'm doing, I'm doing a bunch of beans right now. I'm getting a bunch of beans planted on field 14, or 15 right now at the moment. Um, I'm just trying to make as much money as I really can. I want to pay off those leases and loans I got out right now. Just not doing too good for me. Negative, hashtag, hashtag bankrupt. I saw somebody post in the chat. Um, yeah, that's not good for us right now, so we really need to get that under control. What is this guy doing over here? Full? Yeah, you gotta be full. I really like this, uh, this combine. Alright, so we'll just slide this right here, get it back and ready for the next time. We're gonna back our... Silverado. Yep, we are maxed out. Oh, okay, it's 90, 98%. So I guess he just maxes it out a little bit under what it should be. But um, I'm going to be buying a Ford here soon. I think a Ford 350 or 450. I think it was, I think it was a 450. Um, it's a dually. I got to gotta have the dually. got to have that extra pull power, extra friction for that contact. But um, yeah, so we're going to be buying a Ford here soon. Don't be wrong, everybody. I love this Silverado. Um, not Silverado, Duramax. <laughs> I love the Duramax, um, but I think I think everybody wants me to change it up. But I'll ask you guys for the Ford. Comment down below what do you want the color to be. Uh, so yeah, just if you guys yeah, if you make it this far in the video, uh, just comment down below what you want the color of the Ford to be. Pretty sure there's like every single color you can choose from. We can do this this blue again. I really like blue, blue is my favorite color. Or we can do whatever you guys want. Just comment down below and tell me, and that will be what we decide. No, oh, I need to zoom out here. Yeah, but this Duramax is really nice because the turning on it is super, super crisp and super well done. Uh, all right, we need to drop off our eggs too. Somebody told me in the comments, yeah, you need to sell your eggs. I do agree, I need to. Alright, let's go around here. So it looks like with this trailer we can do about um drive over this. Alright, let's see what happens. Uh oh. Interesting. We can't place bunkers, can we? Well. Alright, so it looks like we're going to need to completely clear out all that chaff. Maybe toss it in one of these. Not chaff, uh, silage. 
So let's go look and see what's the biggest bucket we can find. That's what we got right now, and that holds like nothing. Silage cutter. We need something with a big bucket. Hmm. Okay, well that kind of tosses a wrench in the plans. Oh, okay. Maybe I might have to go look for a mod, everybody. I think I might go get a mod that, um... Here, let me hop out. I think I might have to go get a mod that'll let me pick up a lot of that, because that's 60-some thousand? 59,000, um, which would be approximately, like, 47, 46 different small universal bucket loads. Um, I don't think there's any other bigger bucket load, bigger buckets, so that's what I'll have to go get. I'll have to go get one of those. But, uh, yeah, so I could pretty much went over, we didn't do much this episode. We just kind of touched up with the cows, did that kind of, that sort of thing. Um, but definitely, ne by next episode, I will hopefully be unbankrupt. I'm just going to do a lot of playing off screen, guys. Just a lot of farming, basically. Um, just make it as much money as you can. A lot of soybeans, a lot of stuff with cows. I'll be get I'll get everything ready and I'll have this guy cleared out and hopefully by next episode you guys will see this bunker maybe maybe up to this midline. Hopefully that'll be a lot of work for me. That'll probably be about four or five hours worth of off camera. But I mean I gotta do it, so that's what I gotta do. So thank you everybody for watching. If you guys got any ideas or anything for me? Oh I need to put more straw in there. Uh any sorry about that. Any more ideas or anything for me, uh, just comment down below. Let me know. I read you guys' comments every single time. I may not respond to them, but I do see them. So don't you worry about that. Uh, but thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you're not subscribed yet. And I will see everybody in the next Farming Simulator video.